Hey guys, it's the Gone Crafter 3 here, and today I have a really small, fast, and compact 2x3 nether portal in the wall. Um, so let me show you it closing and opening. So, as you can tell, it's really fast. Um, and here's the redstone. First, let me say this diamond is just the input. I'm just going to get rid of it so you can see the input there. And yeah, here's the rest of the redstone. Pretty small. Um, so, let's get on to the tutorial. Alright, so, first what you want to do is have a little 2x3 area here, right here. Um, and just to get this out of the way, just put two sticky pistons facing up with your block of choice on it. Then you'll get two dispensers and face them towards the portal. And, uh, make sure they're dispensers, not droppers. Then you'll have eight sticky pistons here facing towards the portal. And then your block of choice there. Um, now onto the wiring. I'll just use diamond as the input, which is right there. Uh, okay. So now you'll have redstone here. Oops. And then a repeater on two ticks. And you'll also need redstone right there. And now get two torches on there. Downward sticky piston with the redstone block on it. Going into a repeater on one tick. Then the same on the other side. Like that. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and put a lever here. Okay, now block there. That's for the water. Um, redstone like this. And then two redstone torches on both sides. Um, here, have a repeater and redstone coming from the torch. Now on this side, you'll just go down two blocks and place redstone and a regular piston. Now back up to here, we'll have a downwards facing re uh, regular piston with any block there and there. And then a redstone block right there. And then one block beneath the glass, or your, this block here, you'll have a regular piston, and then we can do the circuit for whoops, these pistons down here. Have a regular piston there, whoops, and then two repeaters. That's not a repeater. That's not a repeater. There we go. <laughs> With two redstone, and that is pretty much it. So let's click that. It closes and it opens. So now let's get the actual stuff in there. Okay, water in the right one and flint and steel in the left. Flip the lever. And there it goes, it works. So I hope you guys like this cool tutorial. Uh, it's pretty, f it's really fast. That's the main reason I like it. And it's compact. Uh, if you guys didn't catch the dimensions the first time here it is four by four four by six by seven with a volume of 168 uh so yeah uh hope you guys use this in your bases and i hope it comes to use for you guys uh thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys next time